I thought you were a snob. Ha, sorry na. Mabango ang hininga, lalo na pag gumakanta. Parang ang sarap amoyin. High maintenance, kaya single. Single that. Gabi naman. Um... guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Daghang gigain salamat for clicking. Uh, if you're new here, welcome. May bagabot diri sa atong pamilya diri sa YouTube. Maraming maraming salamat. Thank you for joining us. Ngayon, uh, we're going to do something the first time kung gagawin dito sa aking uh, YouTube channel. We're doing a mukbang and uh, as far as I know, ang ginagawa sa mukbang ay kumakain in front of the camera. So, yan ang gagawin natin ngayon. And uh, kung napanood nyo ang ating previous vlog, uh, pinakita namin sa inyo kung paano lutuin itong napakasarap na favorite dish ko na niluluto ni Mals, uh, aking nanay na ginataang crab. And kakainin natin siya ngayon dito sa video natin. So sabayan nyo kung kumain, uh, grab some food there kung ano mga gustong kainin nyo dyan uh, sa inyong kanya-kanyang mga bahay. And uh, while doing this mukbang, we're also gonna be answering some assumptions about me. So nagpost ako ng uh, stories. I posted on my Instagram and I asked you guys for your assumptions about me. Kung ano ba yung mga first impressions nyo or uh, ano ba yung mga inassume nyo about me as a person. And we're either going to uh, confirm or debunk these assumptions about me. So, uh, simulan na natin. Kain na tayo. So, meron ako dito ngayon yung uh, niluto namin na ginataang crab. Nakikita nyo ba? Sobrang sarap dito. Mm, bango. Siyempre, hindi mawawala ang kanin at ang tubig pampatulak. So, uh, ayan. Kain na tayo. Kailangan natin ng rice. Siyempre, hindi mawawala yan. At itong ating crab. Siyempre, doon tayo sa sipit. Naku, ito yung pinakamasarap. Ito yun, guys. Oh. Uh, juicy! Kaya natin ang maraming maraming sauce na natin. Mm! The best! Yes! Sobrang sarap. Mm! Sarap! Okay, first uh, assumption about me. Sabi dito, perfectionist. Uh, yes, feeling ko minsan nagiging problem na siya. I'm very meticulous about the things that I do. And lagi kong kina-quality control lahat ng mga ginagawa ko. Minsan nahihirapan na ako kasi kailangan, for me, kailangan perfect lahat. And I mean, it's not really healthy kasi nothing's perfect, nobody's perfect. So, Pero ako kasi so, sobrang meticulous ako sa lahat ng mga bagay. Eh. Minsan pag hindi siya up to my standards, for example, content or songs or kung ano mang klaseng creative output. Kung hindi siya pasok sa mga standards ko, minsan hindi ko nalang nilalabas. Kasi ganun ako ka ano eh, ganun ako ka perfectionist. So, nakakarelate. Don't talk when your mouth is full. Kaya din ba guys, nakakarelate din ba kayo? Next assumption. Ito galing kay Jan, batchmate ko nung high school. Sabi niya, abidude na kung hilumun o shy type ka sa una. Haha, <laughs> miss you Jace. Hey Jan, miss you too. Usually, yan ang mga sinasabi sa akin na uh, shy type daw ako or tahimik daw ako. Which is true. Usually kasi it takes a while for me to open up sa mga tao. So, usually ang uh, impression nila sa akin ay mahihain or tahimik. Pero once you get to know me and once I become, you know, comfortable with you, makwento naman ako. And, uh, you know, I like to converse and have uh, exchange of ideas. And makulit din naman ako. So, it just takes a while for me to open up. Uh, when it comes to ano naman performances, Sobrang shy ako dati And then siguro kumapal na lang yung mukha ko Dahil sa una yung pagkaharana Yung trabaho ko before The Voice And throughout the years medyo na nahasa ako na yung You know being in front of an audience or a crowd And uh, performing in front of the camera So usually ano lang talaga Fake it till you make it Kung kahit mahihain kayo Sobrang hiya mo Magpretend ka lang na confident ka And uh, magiging okay din naman yung uh, performance mo Next assumption Mabango ang hininga, lalo na pag gumakanta. Parang ang sarap amuhin. Gabi naman. Um, I'd like to think so. Uh, hopefully, sana mabango ang hininga ko. Uh, as much as possible, nagtutuplos naman ako. I practice proper dental hygiene. I uh, brush my teeth. I floss and I use mouthwash. 
So, sana naman. Sana mabango ang hininga ko pag nagpa-perform. The best talaga to. Next assumption. Ito, maraming, marami akong nakukuha ganito. I thought you were a snob. Ha, sorry na. Ayun uh, nga, as I mentioned earlier, siguro dahil sa pagiging introvert ko and uh, sa pagiging mahihain ko, napagkakamalan akong snob. Pero, ayun lang, minsan kasi nagaantay lang ako na mauna yung uh, tao na batiin ako bago ako bumati. Kaya siguro na may misinterpret as snob or masungit. Pero guys, I'm like... I'm super friendly. Once you get to know me, approach nyo lang ako. Uh, just say hi and I will say hi back. Siguro, nadadala lang talaga sa pagiging introvert or sa pagiging mahihain. But uh, the next time you see me, mag lang kayo and I will say hi back. Hindi ako maso. I won't bite. Hindi ako nakakagat. Except dito, kinakagat ko kasi sobrang sarap pag kalami kayo. Nakabutan nga na itong daghang sus. Nga daghan nga. Kanun. Okay, ang susunod na stasyon ay Taft. Susunod na assumption, high maintenance kaya single. Parang hindi naman. Guys, sobrang simple lang ako. Uh, madali lang akong pasayahin. I don't think uh, kaya ako single dahil high maintenance. I find that the simplest things are the ones that make me happy. I don't know why some people think na I'm high maintenance or whatever, pero no, hindi naman. I hope not. Uh, sa ngayon kasi, I'm happy on my own and it's not really a priority right now. Kung dumating, hindi masaya. Eh, kung wala, hindi eh, wala. Hmm. Pero, yeah, sabi ko nga sa unang-unang vlog ko, alone but not lonely. Diba? So, Kailangan masaya muna kayo on your own bago kayo makahanap ng magmamahal sa inyo, na magpapasaya sa inyo. Diba? Mm, cheers! Kaya tayo. Next assumption! Alam mo ba nung nakita kita sa TV feeling ko sobrang bait mo tapos na-meet kita? Totoo nga. Thank you! Galing yung kay TJ. Marami marami salamat. Um, I, uh, eh, hopefully, ay uh, lahat ng mga naging uh, interactions ko with my supporters ay Sana ay naging uh, positive sa inyo. I'd like to show kindness and uh, positivity to my supporters when I meet them. Ako kasi fan din ako. Lahat naman kasi siguro tayo, di ba, fan of someone. And uh, sabi nga nila minsan, di ba, don't meet your idols because they might disappoint you. So, ako, pag uh, may mga supporters ako na nami-meet, and you never know if that's the only time they're going to meet you, and um, just meeting you alone makes their day. Pero, di ba, you know, we're all human, and may mga times na wala tayo sa mood, or it's just not our day that day. As much as possible, ha, I'm not saying I'm perfect, I also have my days. Pero, as much as possible, if I'm going through something, or I'm not really in the best mood, or galit ako, I try to keep that to myself, or I try to keep that at home, or in the car. Pero once I'm outside and once I meet my supporters, I, you know, I try to be the best version I can be for them. Kasi parang thank you ko na sa kanila for being there, for supporting me always. Kasi utang ko sa kanila yung ano eh, kung ano may meron ako ngayon. Kasi kung hindi dahil sa kanila, diba, wala, wala ako dito ngayon. Kaya, yun na lang yung, it's the least that I can do to thank them for their support. Is, you know, at least to be nice to them. Okay, next assumption. Magaling sama. Parang hindi naman. Kaya ako nag-singer eh, kasi hindi tayo magaling sa mat eh. Pero, sa grade school, hindi ko alam kung bakit, sinama nila ako sa math club. Tsaka sumali ako ng parang inter-school math competition, parang math quiz competition. Siguro nung mga time na yun, magaling pa ako sa math. Ngayon kasi wala na akong natatandaan eh. Pero naalala ko rin dati in high school, uh, favorite ko dating subject was geometry. Ewan ko ngayon kung may na-retain pa ng mga information, pero dati eh, yun ang favorite ko na branch of math. Next assumption, meat freak. Ay, totoo yan. Di ko rin alam kung bakit, but uh, na-instill sa akin at a very young age that cleanliness is next to godliness. Dati pa man, sobrang meticulous na rin ako sa paglilinis. I clean my own room. I uh, wash my own clothes. And natutuwa ako at a very young age to be independent uh, in that aspect of my life. I like my clothes arranged a certain way. Na ano ako na babother ako pag hindi symmetrical yung mga bagay. Kailangan symmetrical sila. I don't know, it's some kind of weird wiring sa brain ko na... Kunyari, pag may nakikita akong painting na medyo askew siya ng konti, kailangan ko siyang ayusin kasi hindi ako makakalma. I wouldn't have that peace of mind kung hindi ko naayos yun. Yeah, and I have my own way of organizing my clothes. I'm going to insert a video of my closet here. Little preview. Gusto nyo ba makakita ng uh, closet tour dito sa channel natin? Let me know. Comment down below if you wanna see that. 
Next assumption. Rich kid since bata pa. Hey, hey. Nako. Siguro if I would uh, classify our way of living before, siguro middle class kami. I mean, I'd like to think that we were just living a simple lifestyle. Um, we were blessed enough and fortunate enough to be able to go to private schools and be able to, you know, at least have the basic necessities. I am very privileged and very fortunate to have those things. But I wouldn't consider myself as a rich kid by a long shot because we were just living a simple life in Butuan. And it was a good life even if it was simple. It's because it's important to be together. Next assumption. That you're a meat freak and konyo. Ayan na mention ko na kanina na sobrang meat freak ko nga. But konyo? Dude! I'm not konyo, ano ba? What the heck? I'm not konyo kaya. Like, dude. Who said that I'm konyo? I don't understand na you call me konyo. That's so not totoo, man. Like, wow. Me, konyo, ta. Ano, lamik mabit ni. Next assumption. Has many friends. Hmm. Hopefully. Sana marami din ako mga kaibigan, pero once that I consider really, really close, like yung mga ano ko talaga, ride or die na mga friends that I would consider some of my best friends, um, probably around 10, probably less than that. Mm, talagang maaasahan ko na will always be there for me and uh, I consider like almost family na. And those are the friends that will always be there for you no matter what. And you don't have to have, you know, lots of friends. I mean, some people are those kinds of people and that's amazing for them. Pero, you know, you only need like a core group of people that will always have your back and will be a true friend for you for life. Next assumption, introvert, nictophilia, nictophilia, frustrated theater actor and cheese lover. Introvert, yes. Nictophilia, balikan natin yan. Frustrated theater actor, yeah, siguro, um, I would love to do theater someday. Kasi I went to school for musical theater sa UST eh, and I haven't really practiced that facet of my craft. So, I would love to do theater also. Gusto ko matayo din yan. And cheese lover, yes. I really love cheese. Cheese is God's gift from heaven. I-google natin yung nictophilia na yan, anong ibig sabihin niya? Nictophilia. Noun. An attraction to darkness or night. Finding relaxation or comfort in the darkness. Yeah, siguro. Kasi sa kwarto ko, gusto ko na super madilim. Pag natutulog, kailangan naka-blackout lahat yung mga kurtina. And when I do my house tour in the future, abangan nyo yan, you're gonna see na mahilig ako sa black paint sa mga walls. And yeah, also I'm more of a night person. Um, hindi mo akong magigising talaga siguro before 10 or 11. Unless it's for work. Kasi talagang I'm just wired to be nocturnal, I guess. Kasi doon ako nagpa-function. I tried a couple of times to wake up really early, pero I just keep coming back to waking up at around 12 or around 11. Siguro earliest ko 10. And feeling ko sobrang aga na niyan for me. So I'm never a morning person. Nictophilia. Very interesting. See, you learn something new every day. Next assumption, single dad. Single dad? Why would you think na may anak na ako? Single dad. Um, sa pagkakaalam ko, hindi naman. Kung may naanak ka naman ako dyan na nanonood dito sa video na to, um, pakilala ka, handa kong panagutan yung baby natin. Um, hindi ko lang sure ha, pero as far as I know, hindi naman ako single dad. Next assumption, mahilig mag-selfie. Haha, hindi naman. Hindi naman ako masyadong mahilig mag-selfie. Kunti lang, mga siguro tatlo, dalawa. Yung ano lang, yung saktong number ng selfie lang. Yung sakto lang, yung hindi naman masyadong, hindi naman OA, hindi naman excessive, di ba? Sakto lang. Okay, next assumption. Shy person, ayan, nasagot ko na kanina. Snap, ayan, di ba sabi ko maraming nagsasabi na snap daw ako. Anak mayaman, ayan, nasagot ko na rin kanina. Hmm, siguro, yeah. Last one, pizza lover. Yes! Yes! Pizza is my favorite food. So, alam nyo na guys, kung, uh, kung gusto nyo akong pasayain, bigyan nyo lang ako ng pizza. Kasi that is my favorite food, is the pizza. Pag nagano ako, pag nagmukbang ako ulit, yun na yung kakainin ko sa inyo. Pag nagbukbang ako ulit, yun na yung kakainin ko. So you guys can see how I worship the church of pizza. Kasi pizza is the best. It's God's gift to humankind.
Ah, syempre, masarap din naman to. Siyempre, favorite ko to sa lahat ng mga luto ni Mars. Yung nyo guys, napakadali lang lutuin to. Konti lang pala ng ingredients. Akala ko napaka-complicated na kasi sabang sarap. But if you guys want to recreate this, you can just watch my previous vlog kung saan nagluto kami ni Mars nitong uh, kinataang ka. Napakadali lang. If you guys do make this recipe, please uh, take a photo of it and, or video and then tag me para makita ko. Para ma-experience nyo rin kung gano'ng kasarap ang ginataang alimago ni Mars. Okay, so last bite, kuha tayo ng malaking malaking piece. One for the road. Ayun, ayan, sarap. Lagyan natin syempre ng maraming maraming sauce. So those are some of your assumptions about me. Hopefully nasagot ko yun. And hopefully I was able to shed more light on uh, who I am as a person. And I was able to confirm or debunk some of the assumptions that you made about me. And sana na-enjoy nyo itong mukbang natin. Let me know if you guys wanna do this again. And kung anong klaseng pagkain ang gusto nyo kainin ko. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Again, please do subscribe to my channel. Click the notification bell so you get notified every single time I upload a new video. And please do watch out for some of my upcoming videos here in my channel. Every Wednesday, I post a new vlog. And every Saturday, I post a new cover. So, sana abangan nyo yan. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching again. Marami marami salamat. This is for you. And cheers. Bye guys. Thank you. Ayo ayo. I'm Pink Permi. Thank you guys.